morning, everyone. Thanks for watching No School News. This is Rohan speaking for today. And for today's news, on March 22nd, 9.15 in the morning, there was a murder that occurred in room D107. A body can be found near the back storage area where the victim was on the ground dead. Here, you can see the victim minding their own business. But as you can see, behind them was an unknown person slowly walking up to them suspiciously as they held a strange weapon. It was not then they aimed the weapon and fired a projector hitting the back of the head, leaving the victims fall to the ground, lifeless. The weapon at hand seems to be handmade and uses compressed air to launch projectiles. However, we question about its origin and any unknown properties it has that could be a threat to human society. A few moments later, we can see the figure fleeing away from the scene. We don't know their current whereabouts since it is unknown on the type of escape they used. Here, we have Nathan Tiquez, one of the witnesses who was near the scene. Tell me, Nathan, what can you say about this situation? Well, I was just sitting over there minding my own business when all of a sudden I hear this loud kaboom sound like it was from a cannon. I look over to see a figure in a black hoodie running away from the body. I couldn't get a good look at their face since people were panicking left and right and blocking my view, but it was really scary because I didn't know what was happening. The strangest part was when I looked over at the body, there was no blood at all. I, I couldn't believe it. I don't know if it was magic of some sort, but I hope it doesn't happen to me. Thank you for the information, Nathan. According to several agents, it seems that these cases were the cause of this hooded figure. As from this case and previous ones, victims killed didn't have any injuries nor wounds on them. However, upon dissecting the body of the victim, there were several bones broken around the neck and the skull alongside the brain being crushed. It is unknown how the figure does it, but we do know that it's possible that they may be a threat to this community. Thank you for joining us tonight. We'll see you on the next report on No School News. Have a good night. <sighs> well, that's finished. Guess I can go now. Oh, it's my phone. Shit. Hello? Yeah. What about the murderer? News information? Oh, really? What is it then? What? So you're saying that the fucking murderer is an anomaly that steals people's identity? Oh shit, who the fuck are you?